Okay, I'm going to uh, briefly explain uh, what is meant by the hard ways in uh, the game of craps. Now, what we have here at the top, two and two for a total of four, obviously, and at the bottom, a three and a one. That's called a hard four at the top. It came two by two. The one at the bottom is called a soft four. It can be three, one, or one, three. Now over here, we have what is called a hard 10 up at the top, five and five, and a soft 10 down at the bottom, four and six. Or also, it could be six and four. That's the difference, a hard 10 is five and five. The other one is a, called a soft 10. Now over here, up at the top, we have a hard six. And that's three by three. Now right below it, we have what is called soft sixes. And that's two by four, or it could also be four by two. And at the bottom one is one by six or six by one. So the hard four is the three by three. The hard six, excuse me, is three by three. And the other two are soft sixes. Then over here, we have the hard eight. And again, that's four by four. They have to be identical. And then out below that, we have the soft eights. Three and five, or five and three. Six and two, or two and six. The hard, the soft eights. So up at the top, I'm going to put them all together, or close together. They're all the different varieties of your hard ways. Four, ten, six, and eight. Now, what is uh, what happened was a number of years ago, uh, Mother Teresa was having some uh, difficulty in. Uh, getting money for one of the orphanages, so uh, a group of us volunteered to help and we set up a Monte Carlo night in one of the orphanages. And we had a craps layout, but we didn't have a craps table. So what we had to do, we had to put two of the orphanages, uh, two of the orphans' beds together, use that as the craps table and just put the layout on that. Then we had the craps game going. Anyway, uh, that didn't work out too good. We got into a lot of trouble because of it. You know, I, you know, I thought it was a good idea personally, but uh, anyway. So uh, we got into trouble because of that. And I got a nasty note from the uh, director, you know, saying that um, the amount of damage that was done to the orphans the only thing that kept the orphanage going was a miracle. And the only good thing about it was that the miracle was attributed to Mother Teresa, which aided her in the beatification process. So I told him that, you know, that was our plan all along. And I uh, naturally I offered to help again. And he said, uh, we, we want you to go and be a missionary in uh, Antarctica. All right, that's about it. There's your hard ways. See ya. Thank you. Bye.